So for today's video, I thought I would do a what I eat in day. I haven't done one of these in a little while, so I thought I might as well do one for a spring update. So I'm actually doing two workout programs right now, and I have some of those frozen egg bites downstairs, so we're gonna make some of those for breakfast and some energize. But we're gonna head downstairs, grab those, put them in the microwave, and let's go going. And I wrote my computer down so that I can do some work downstairs. I've been working up in my room lately and I have some blog posts that I have to do and some Facebook stuff. So we're going to uh, get going with some breakfast. So I got these to finish up. So we're going to have these. So while those are cooking, let's make some pre-workout. So while it's cooking, we're gonna make pre-workout because it's taking forever to cook.
So it's lunchtime. We are gonna go upstairs to make our usual lunch, which I do like this salad thing. That lettuce, but we're gonna try these too. I got them in a grocery video and so I thought we'd try these out as well. They're the macaroni and cheese triangles, but apparently you have to cook them on a pan or in a deep fryer, which I didn't know. So we're gonna try these as well. need a big one so So I said to cook for 12 to 14 minutes, so that's what we're going to do. We're already starting to do something. So we're going to let those go. Oh, wait, I'm going to have some. I flipped these already. I don't know if it's too early or not, but it's uh, not like they were burning. So I did flip them. But, like, I don't know. Let's see. I wish there was like an air fryer instruction. I've only been on here for like five minutes, but. They're already kind of burnt, so what I'm going to do is I think I'm going to take these off and then try them, and if they're not good, then I'll put them in the microwave because they're burning. And I have it on medium heat, like I said. So. One of them is not really burnt. And then on one side is. Like this one here is the only one that's not really that burnt. So. Let me grab a fork. Okay. Let's see. Let's try this one. That's not. The outside is nice. But I don't know. So, if you have an induction stove, you only need like five minutes because these are cooked. They're not the greatest either. Um, I give these like a five. They're not very good. Okay, so since my camera just died and the product that I just tried on camera was bad, 
Bailey wants to say hi. Um, I'm gonna make my usual lunch because it was so bad that I need some more food. So we are going to make some new food. And Bailey wants some, but she's not gonna have any, so. I'm gonna get some supplies. The boy's on a walk, so I can make this more freely than I could if he was here. So, let's get making. And I don't really have a tripod to put you up against because the tripod that I use, it uh, films the other way. So, I'm not sure I can try it. Okay, we'll see how this ends up working. I don't know if it's gonna work out well or not because the way that you're positioned. But anyway, I'm gonna skip the tomato today and we're just gonna do cucumber with the meats and the cheese. So I'm gonna cut up some cucumber. We got a nice fat cucumber today. So. And I will give Bailey some of the cucumber. You're gonna see me cutting right now. Okay, so you can have these two fat ones. It's a nice looking cucumber too. Yeah. Okay, that's gonna be for her. And then I like to cut mine into fours just so that it is easier to eat when it's in a salad. Alright, because it's not even really a salad, it's because it doesn't have lettuce. So. It started as like a sub in a tub and I got the recipe from Pinterest, which is where I get everything from mainly. And um, it uh, was like that Jersey Mike's one that went viral, but I made an alteration on it because as far as I know, we don't have Jersey Mike's here or at least not one near me. So I was like, you know what, I'll just make like what I would make uh, when I go to Subway or like Mr. Sub. So, yeah. Um, and when I go to like Subway or Mr. Sub, I get the cold cut version or the assorted is what it's called, depending on where you go. So I get that, and that's basically what I'm making. It's just I'm not using the same like um, dressing that I would get when I go there. And I always cut three or four pieces of pepperoni because I'm cutting in pepperoni. And just enough that this can save for the next time. And even these ones I cut into fours. Tonight's dinner, I don't know what I'm having yet because it's a work night for me at the hospital, so we usually end up doing something like grilled cheese, which I did last night, or like egg, like poached egg, like the egg McMuffin type thing, or sometimes we do hamburgers or macaroni casserole, spaghetti, soup, whatever. Um, so I don't, don't really know what we're having yet. So, 
our way in with some chicken lunch meat. And I always do about four or five slices of this. And I don't cut it the same way I cut the pepperoni. I cut it into strips first. And then once it is cut into strips, I then turn on the cutting board and go down to make it into the little tiny pieces. It works better when you have a bigger cutting board. I got a random warning on my phone that I had no storage. Anyway, once it's cut into strips, we put them into here. I don't have a very big phone. I have like a 200 and some odd gig phone and it gets used constantly by apps and stuff that I use. I think I delete the ones I no longer use. But now that we got this ready, we're going to add in some cheese, which I'm gonna put away this stuff at the same time. that we use whatever shredded cheese we got. Today it happens to be the great value one. And then we just want to put as much or as little as we want. I'm not making a big one today, so. That's fine. And then dressing. And then we put this in. And then I'll rinse those off afterwards, but that is what I've been having for lunch lately. I'm gonna rinse off the cutting board and the lid, then go downstairs, finish my pre-workout, watch some YouTube, and then workout. So yesterday, I ended up not finishing on my camera. I recorded some on my phone, but I ended up not recording my dinner because I had to make it super fast to get out on time. So I made an egg McMuffin type thing and then I had milk with it and then when I got to the hospital for my shift midway I got handed a, a beverage uh, from the Tim Hortons girl so I ended up with the French vanilla and then I did come home and have some crumpets because I was hungry and a drink. So that's what I had yesterday uh, but thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe, turn notifications, and notified every time I post. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!